one of nature's most spectacular events, the annual wildebeest migration in East Africa. Every year between May and July, over a million wildebeest set off on a thousand mile journey from Tanzania to Kenya and back. They're following the rains and the water and fresh new grass it brings to the plains. The safari park has a herd of wildebeest too, though it's not a million strong and it doesn't migrate. In fact, there are just four wildebeest here, all boys, and they live very happily in monkey jungle. Wildebeest are slightly odd-looking antelope. They look like they'd be made up of spare parts with front legs longer than their back ones, a permanent look of confusion, and they certainly wouldn't win a beauty competition. But head of section Andy loves them. These guys turned up end of last year, so yeah, fairly new for Longley. They're just a real cool, funky looking animal. I think they're great. The name wildebeest actually means wild cattle, but they have several other names too. They're known as common wildebeest, blue wildebeest, or brindle gnu. So they kind of have three names. And there is actually a, a wonderful song about gnu. I'm a gnu, spelt G-N-U. I'm the nicest work of good nature in the zoo. And it's an easy song to sing along to. How do you do? Well, I am not going to sing that. <laughs> <laughs> what a spoiled sport. But it's a catchy tune and it's just as well because the park's herd of four gnus is set to almost double with three more wildebeest coming from another collection today. Keeper Ryan is looking forward to it. It's always exciting to have new animals turn up. Um, you know, we're all here to look after animals and we want to see the place grow and our herds expand. The three newcomers are just arriving at the park, but the next step, mixing them with the four who already live here, could be a very dangerous time. We've got to see how they all rub along, because they're all boys together, they might start fighting a little bit. Wildebeest are herd animals and they have a very strict hierarchy. In fact, they may fight to the death as they try and work out who's in charge. We'll be back later to see how the introductions go.